Hello YouTube! Kagemaru back once again in Grim Fandango Remastered and... Uh... I did go, uh, kinda look up some stuff, not anything like a guide or anything, but just, uh... Just some hints. Then I'll find some hints online about... Okay, three. Okay, about, uh, what I might need to do next to finish some stuff, and, uh... Say so yeah, I might, uh... Oh, we have some else done here, and also, uh, decided I might, <coughs> might actually record a few episodes of this today. Uh, just get out, get out of head of it a bit. Maybe, uh, maybe, uh, you know, seeing about getting out through the end of year two. We're in year two right now. Uh, yeah, finishing year two, and that might be all I'll record today. Let's see if we can get that far. I don't know how many episodes that'll take. But I'll try to keep it trimmed down. Well, like I said, yeah, I got a few hints, so we're gonna see if they help us out here. I'm just saying that so uh, if by some miracle anyone comments on this, these videos, it might be uh, long past recordings when I see it. Uh, as I said, we're gonna try to finish through year two today. See if we can manage that. Cause I think it might be uh, better. I don't know. It might be better if I know I'm going to be doing a number of videos in one game to try and get recorded a few at once. Also, I forgot to turn right. There we go. Well, don't let me bother you. Always not. I'd hate to end up like this. Then take my advice. Wouldn't match my cufflinks. Huh. Okay, so the thing I'm looking at there is that one of the hints about <laughs> that's specifically about stopping Naran Naranja from getting to the ship. Is uh, you know showing he's proving he's not going to show suggested uh, scene with the coroner about identifying the body. So I think I have to make it so one of the bodies is identified as Naranja. Now we're gonna see how we can do that. The coroner mentioned an ID bracelet, so. Gonna see what if Naran has anything especially identifying. I think it's this way to the to the uh, tattoo parlor, scrum shop parlor, I should say. Cause you're all bones! Aha! Seriously, so freaking long to walk everywhere. Ugh. 
so uh watched the flash last night uh spoiler alert introduction of Wally West don't know what part he's going to wind up playing in the whole thing exactly but it's you know they have a lot of that a lot of name dropping Man, I guess they have like 60 years of Flash history to go over, but go on, drop somebody a bit more original in once in a while. Looks like it hurts. Looks like it hurts. Okay. Looks like it hurts. Is that supposed to be a bunny? Don't you have some fancy club to run someplace? Who did your scrimshaws, dude? You seem to be the only joint in town. I think these are binders of tattoo designs. They're labeled nautical and nice, and a third one just says Anchormania. Go mark some cars or something. Shut up. That's not. Oh, that's what I was hoping. I don't really want to do that. That crazy blade away. No room in here for that kind of thing. Oh, what am I gonna do here? I don't think it's good for much except getting into the high rollers lounge. See, even with the hints, I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do. I'm keeping this little gold mine to myself. It's Toto Santos, Rubacaba's friendly scrimshaw artist. Can I do anything to this air pump? I'm keeping this little gold mine to myself. That makes no sense saying that. Oh god. Maybe we'll see about the uh getting into the uh, wine cellar. Okay. Did I have I did not because that did not go as well as I thought. There's no sign he had an ID bracelet or something. Just... Walk, 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 walk. So slowly... Slowly I turn! on anyone who recognizes that reference. Classic comedy.
I got a hunch the wine comes out here. What are you doing? I wanted some wine. Oh, look at what a mess you have made. Get out of here! Hey, what about my vino? It's not self-serve. You'll just have to wait until I get around to it. This cask is sealed on the top, too. There's no opening up here. I don't want to mess up my blade. Oh, come on! I don't really want to do that. How am I supposed to get into it then? Come on. I'm fairly certain I'm supposed to get into this somehow. I don't really want to do that. I got a hunch the wine comes out here. I told you to stay out of here. I wouldn't have to come in here if the service were a little faster. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so I need to find something to open that. around in the size of Yeah, let me just go over here and try a few things first before I get back down. Oh, as usual, I'm spending a lot of time wandering around here. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. Is there any for anything you do want to do? about doing things do what I tell you to do. Okay. It's a point and click game, do what I want. It says revolutionary design leaves can edges safe and smooth for kitty. Okay, got the can opener. Now we're talking. Bigger must be a 
can open or something. Somewhere. In the room full of giant cat food tins. That's how I say tin. I'm very cultured. But... Yeah, you're just sitting there, you rat. Now, where's my new thingy? It says revolutionary design leaves can edges safe and smooth for kitty. I'd better not open it when it's full. That could spill a lot of juice. I told you to stay out of here. I wouldn't have to cut. Hmm. I told you to. Hmm. Oh, is it really just a matter of just continuing to do this? I told you to. St I wouldn't have. Hmm. I don't know if I just have to keep doing this or what. I got a hunch the wine comes out here. It seems to be taking an awful. I told while. you to. St I would. Hmm. Very repetitive. This one of the few problems I see in this game is there's some some puzzles. It's just do this over and over until something changes. Found that before with the boxing thing in the mouthpiece. I told you. I wouldn't have to come in here. Hmm. I don't have anything to put it in. The can opener wouldn't work there. I told you. I would. <clears throat> I seriously wish I knew if I was going to have to just keep doing this or if I'm supposed to get something else. But the line. I I wouldn't have to come in here if the sir. Hmm. See, it just gets a little monotonous here. Looks like more of that cat meat or whatever that is. Looks like more of that cat meat or whatever that is. Not picking that up. So, so I think told you to stay out of here. A <laughs> meal excuse. Oh, me excuse. Yeah, yeah, shut up, you piker. Oh, well, I can't 
You're getting a little stuck again. Oh, yeah. Do I need to just keep hitting it or find something to Keep the wine in. These plates are filthy. Nothing in the dishwasher. The sink is full of dirty hookah water. Looks like it's open mic night. Testing, testing. Good evening. I like to read a poem. You said this to me in your sleep. Can you hear what I'm suffering? Oh, uh, this is gonna be. Break, Break the, the mirror, mirror with your, your silence. silence. I am more than dead. Myself. Myself. I am sick, and in so being, I am the healthy one. For what purpose? I ache. I am not dead. Beholding wholeness. The end. Gracias. Muchísimas gracias. Oh man, I've got to figure out. I might just guide back because I'm not. I think I'm gonna be able to figure out what they're looking for. Uh, God, that'd be horrible trying to figure that out. No, no, no. That's like. Ugh, I thought I got enough hints, but I may have underestimated how thick I am. It is once again proving very difficult.
Here, let me help you with that. Ah, there's some things a man's got to do for himself. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. Is there anything you want to do? Man? The can opener wouldn't work there. You are the canapana, a mess of second poetry. Calavera Cafe, back here. Oh, right into the cold. Oh, God. Get up the stairs already! So bad, there was a quicker way to get around. You just strolling all over the place. It's A desk. Ah, le numéro gagnant, le 16, rouge, perémant, 16, red, house pays all winners, le banque paye. Mesdames et messieurs, faites vos jeux s'il vous plaît. Ladies and gentlemen, please place your bets. Mesdames et messieurs, rien ne va plus. Les jeux sont. Ladies and no more bets. Look up below. Le numéro gagnant. Le neuf. Rouge. Empire Monk. Nine. Red. This is an outrage. I bet on number two. Why didn't it come up number two? Ah, oh, monsieur, je suis vraiment désolé. I do not pick the winners. These things are all controlled by the man upstairs. Well, please tell uh. the man upstairs that Police Chief Bogan was very upset when he left. And when he returns later this evening, he would prefer to have better luck. Oui, monsieur. Bonsoir. I will definitely tell him. Mesdames et messieurs, f ladies, mesdames et messieurs, les jeux sont faits. Ladies and gentlemen, no more bets. Le numéro gagnant, le 15, noir, Empire 50, black. Okay. That, the chief. I've yeah. always meant to hide that better. Got the chief out of there anyway, so whatever. Ah, to sleep. 
Perchance to have nightmares about spiders and beavers. I know, man. My wartime communications from Salvador. He's been sending me messages like this for the last year. Agent Calavera, I have word that you arrived in Rubacaba safely. This is great news, as your service to the LSA may now continue. I am pleased to report the successful hatching of the eggs you liberated. The hatchlings, which Eva has named Manny and Meche, are quite healthy and eager to serve our cause. With luck, my next letter will be borne to you across the sky by these young gossamer wings of truth. For the revolution, Salvador Limones. I'm not done reading it yet, but maybe later. Okay, maybe I can use that somewhere. No. I did not know I had an office there, so... Never mind, I'm going downstairs. No, it's just her again. glass or anything here. That's belly boogers. Everything okay down here? What happened to Monsieur Bogan's lucky streak? It ran out. What? So did he. While they're losing. Okay, so he's gone. Whatever that does for me. Um, is there anything else to gain from being here? So I shall not be here. Calavera, it is indeed a great day for the revolution. Say hola to little Manny, the first enlisted messenger to serve the LSA. Please feed him some breadcrumbs and send him back quickly, so we may know that our maiden flight was a success. Manuel, I am sorry to hear that you have not heard from your meche. You must be patient and let your heart remain open. If it is meant to be, you will someday be reunited. Ha! Ah, he still thinks I'm in love with her. Manuel, we have found the head of the serpent. Using the computer access you provided us, we picked up a thread that led us to the man who corrupted the Department of Death. His name is Hector Le Mans. Once a small-time racketeer, he has grown fat and powerful by robbing the newly dead. Watch out for the name Hector Le Mans, Manuel. And be careful. Dear friend, our movement now has true momentum, and our numbers are rapidly growing. Much of this is due to our communications and intelligence systems both of which we owe to you. In light of your contributions, I would like to announce your promotion to special agent status. I, Salvador Limones of the Lost Souls Alliance, salute you, Manuel Calavera. You are a great ally in this noble revolution. Great news. We've discovered a new secret talent of our tiny messengers. We don't know how they do it, but these mysterious birds can actually find their targets just by looking at a photograph of the addressee. To celebrate, Eva has made them all little berets. I'll send you some pictures. Okay. Manuel, I am troubled by reports of you buying the automat and converting it into a nightclub. It's fine for you to be comfortable in Rubacaba for your long stay, but I pray you haven't lost sight of the larger goals. It is not this world, but the next in which our true glory lies. Uh, Manny's only larger goal is finding Meche. I just got this one today. Beware, Manuel, for you are in grave danger. Somehow rumor has spread on the streets of El Marro of your presence in Rubacaba. If this information reaches Hector Lamans, he surely will send his evil operatives after you. You must give up your search for Mercedes for the time being, and please, be out of Rubacaba on the next ship. I think he's exaggerating the danger a little, but I do feel pretty stupid for putting my name on the big sign. Agent Calavera, I have word that you arrived in Rubacaba safely. This is great news, 
as your service to the LSA okay, may now continue. Over. I am pleased to report the successful hatching of the eggs you liberated. The hatchlings, which Eva has named Manny and Meche, are quite healthy and eager to serve our cause. With luck, my next letter will be born to you or the revolution, Salvador Limones. So we did get something done now. So uh, since we done that got the uh, got the letters and got Chief Borkin out of the casino there. Uh, I think we might call it for this episode. Uh, got a couple of things done, not the things I was hoping to get done, but you know, it's all. It's all progress. All steps towards the larger goals. Uh, so yeah, I might check a few more hints, see what I need to do about that stupid poetry reading. And catch y'all next time, so adios, I'll be designing Aloha, all that good stuff. And remember not to put your name on top of the cafe when there's Evil megalomaniacs after you. See ya.